I play Yi's mother, um, and you meet me at the beginning of the film, and my husband has passed away, Yi's father is gone, um, and you see sort of the struggle that Yi is um, dealing with in trying to deal with those emotions of having lost her father and hiding that from her family, um, and that sort of sparks her journey to bring Everest home. I think this is obviously a fun, action-packed adventure, but there's also a lot of symbolism and a lot of emotional subtext to it. Can you talk a little bit about, as a storyteller, what most connected with you when you read the script? Honestly, it's the relationships between Yi and, and my character, her mother. Uh, they're very similar to my relationship with my own mother. Um, and you have that fine balance of wanting to deal with everything yourself and, and being confident, but then realizing that it's important to actually rely on your family. They are your rock. I think I'm just checking if they need you for the group shot. They, they might. You're okay right now. Okay, 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 sorry. I just, we're just here, we're trying to try, false alarm, false alarm. Um, and obviously it's an embarrassment of riches with this voice cast. Can you talk about the extent to which you got to share time with them and what we can expect from those performances? Well, first of all, the cast is incredible and the performances are really incredible. Um, unfortunately, as with voiceover often, I was alone for, for most of it and I got to meet them after the fact. Um, but they're, everybody is in for a treat. They're all really, really talented. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is that yeah. from the Goonies? Yeah, indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey!